Hey guys, hope everyone's having a great day. I wanted to show you guys how to do um, a signature on the form that is needed once you have to move someone. So with Young Living, you can move someone within five days for a phone call. Uh, within 20 days, you can send an email to resolutions. Uh, but the other way is you can move someone after that time, but you have to get three levels of upline approval. And what that means is you have to have um, the leadership or the, the people that are in leadership um, levels, three levels above. So you can work with um, your sponsor on who those people are, uh, but they have to be active for an entire year to qualify. So those are just some things you need to know. But anyway, so what you're going to do, the best way that I found is to... Uh, share the document in um, Google. So someone shared this with me and I'm sharing it with you. And so just wanted to show you kind of a little bit of what to do. So when you get the upline approval, this is what it's gonna look like. And you're gonna go to your line that you need to do. So what you'll do is you'll click on and you're gonna just type in your information here. Um, and there's lines and you can like be all perfect if you want and get rid of that if you want, but um, you're gonna type in your information and then your name. And then So anyways, and then you can go ahead and get it all in the right spot. And this isn't all necessary if you don't want. You can leave all these different lines here. But some of us that are perfectionists want to move them away. So we'll do that. Um, and then what you're going to do is you are going to click on the space that you need to sign and then you will go up to insert. You're going to go to drawing. This page takes a minute to load. Once it does, you're going to go over here next to this little line. There's a drop down. You're going to select scribble. And then you're going to make your fabulous, whatever your signature is. This is not mine, but I'm just showing you for the sake of showing you. So it's going to pop up. And it's going to be like, whoa, look how big it is. What in the world? So you click on it, find the little corner. You're just going to kind of make it smaller so that it fits on top of the line. Okay. Then you'll see up here, all changes saved in drive. So you can just stop that. Just stop it. No, <laughs> but you can be done and know that it was saved. And then check with the person that sent this to you and say, hey, I updated it, did you see that? So anyways, I hope this helps you guys. I know that um, this isn't something that we do a, a lot of the time. You have to pay actually to move people. So it's something that we do um, here and there. So just keep this in your back pocket for the next time you possibly need to make a change. Um, and we're always here to help you. So get with your uh, direct mentor or the person that enrolled you and we can help. All right. Thanks you guys. I hope this helped you uh, to kind of see what you need to do and how.